Guys, hope all is well with you on this Monday. I want to talk to you about one more matchup that's going to be coming up on Wednesday, May 26th. Uh, it's going to be the Memphis Grizzlies going up against the Utah Jazz in game two of their series. Memphis shocked me and the Jazz and uh, won game one. Uh, kudos to Memphis. John Morant, Dylan Brooks had a, an amazing game. Uh, great job on his part. Uh, on the other end, Utah just turned the ball over too much. And, and uh, same thing that Golden State did against these guys. It seems like, um, you know, we keep talking about turnovers when it comes to the Memphis Grizzlies. And perhaps it's just their defense causing all these turnovers. But sure does seem like uh, the Jazz were awfully loose with the basketball and a lot of unforced errors there. Uh, some of that's probably rust. Um, and the other part of that is just uh, Memphis playing great defense and, and being all over them and on top of them and making it really difficult on, on them uh, to run their offense. So kudos to Memphis. They're doing a great job. Uh, they're really uh, playing really well right now, definitely better than I thought they would be, be playing at this moment and uh, being able to come in there and, and get game one. Now, Donovan Mitchell, uh, you know, was a surprise scratch. Uh, I thought he'd play. All indications were that he was, he was going to play, and then at all of a sudden, uh, you know, a few hours before tip-off, uh, he's not playing. So uh, that was a little bit of a surprise. I didn't see that one coming. But nevertheless, the Jazz still should have taken care of business. I, I feel that they're, they're the better team. Uh, so I, I think in, in game two, they're, they're favored by seven and a half. Again, I think they're going to cover it. Uh, I really think they're going to going to uh, show up this time and uh, crush Memphis. Uh, I just think they're a lot better than Memphis. So we'll see what happens uh, in game two and see if Memphis can come out and duplicate that performance or not. So uh, thanks, guys, for watching. Uh, let me know what you think about this pick and this prediction, and uh, we'll see what happens in game two. Thanks, guys.